Hi everyone, it's Andrew Roboto here, and welcome to Five Nights at the Mr. Peabody and Sherman Show, where this is a game based off of the movie Mr. Peabody and Sherman, which I actually saw the movie, and it is a pretty interesting movie, I actually like it. And of course, as you can tell by the start of this video, um, there is no music in the main menu, but when we start the game, there will be. Alright, so without further ado, we will select the night like it says right there. Sorry, I, I just I just hit something in my hand by accident. Sorry, but anyways, um, we have all these nights selected: night one, night two, night three, night four, night five, night six, and unlimed night, which I believe that's night seven on the custom night. But anyways, our further ado, we'll start night one. Old abandoned show needs a night guard. One trillion dollars every week. Night one. Okay, here's a tip. Night one only has Mr. Peabody and Sherman. When they appear in the office, click the box with the electricity to make them go away. Ooh, this is actually a nice office. Okay, so we have that fuse box to get rid of them with the electricity. Alright, let's go check the cameras. What the heck? Oh, that camera's disabled. Okay. I think I think some of the cameras are disabled. Cause I don't know why I can't access some of the cameras. I'm guessing they're disabled, that's why. Okay, so I gotta check for Mr. PB and Sherman and when they're there I have to press that fuse box and that will make them go away. Alright. This is this whole office is basically a work office at like home or at your business. It definitely resembles it. It's got a computer on the desk and your phone and pretty much everything you need. Oh, and there's a window. I just realized you can check a window right there. Okay, I saw. Okay, I saw Mr. Peabody. Wait, I think Mr. Peabody's the dog. Sherman's the boy. Okay. Oh yeah, okay, now I remember. Mr. Peabody's the dog, Sherman's the boy. Alright, so I saw Sherman in the office and I had to electrocute him with a shocker and that actually did a pretty good job. I'm still baffled as to why he can't check some of the cameras. Like, it makes that jamming sound like it does with the doors and find it to Freddy's. One and then the flashlight and find it's a Freddy's two. Okay. I do like the office setup. Like this is actually the first game I played with just a generic office and not like a horror themed office. Cause in Five Nights at Freddy's games and most FNAF fan games, like the office is like horror themed. Whereas this one's just a generic and it's actually pretty cool. Okay, there's Mr. Peabody. Got rid of him with the with the fuse box. All right, be gone, Mr. Peabody. Thank you. And then I don't know who we're gonna be dealing with on night two, but we'll see when we beat this night. In fact, Mr. Peabody actually is a talking dog, and he definitely reminds me of Brian and Family Guy, because, I mean, some of the shows have talking dogs, and, like, Stan and Dog Buddha Blog. It's pretty cool. Can we put down the cameras, because they could be coming in any minute. Alright. Let's go check. Alright, just gotta wait for who knows who's coming. Oh, I just had to deal with Mr. Peabody and Sherman back to back. Like that's crazy. I'll I'm gonna press the shocker again. I'm I'm gonna press the fuse box again just to be safe because they were both in the office, so I had to press it twice. That's right. That's why. Okay, and it's 5 a.m. So we're actually doing pretty well on this first night. I mean, that's the thing with night one. It's like usually straight up. It's usually the easiest. Okay. 
Okay, Sherman's in the kitchen, which is pretty interesting. And Mr. Peabody's in, like, some kind of bathroom or something. I don't know what room that is. It looks like a janitor's closet or something. Oh, uh, 6 a.m. Does this game go to, like, 7 a.m. or something? I don't know. I don't know when this game ends at. Like, the night ends. Because it's 6 a.m. Okay. I'm just drinking water. That's what I'm doing. Gotta stay hydrated, of course. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Peabody, I know, move. He's coming in close. Yeah, man! What the hell was that? Oh my god! <laughs> I'm completely speechless as to why I got jump scared and still beat the night. Like, what the heck? I got. This is messed up. I got jump scared by Sherman and I still beat night one. Like, what the heck? I was thinking it was going to be game over completely. Because, I mean, I just sat there completely speechless thinking, like, what the heck? Am I dead? Is it game over after I get jump scared? But. No, apparently I still beat the night. Alright. So anyways, we will be taking on night two in the next video. Thank you for watching, everyone. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you've given me, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.